Guys, you have just had your, your first training session in Wales, reunited as teammates at, at Celtic. Liam, how did it feel when you, you found out Asazi was coming to join you at Celtic? Um, it was a, a good feeling, seeing him come in. Uh, didn't expect it at all, but I'm happy to have someone who I know, like a good teammate. And yeah, it's just nice to have him around. He's a good kid and he'll offer a lot on the pitch and off it. He's a good guy. Well, as I know you said when you, when you signed, it helped the fact that you've got a familiar face yeah, yeah, definitely. right away at Celtic Park. Can I help you settle in, I suppose? Yeah, definitely. It just helps you around, showing you around when I first came in. I kind of lost where to go. Um, Liam helped me out. Um, and it's just good to, obviously, I'm good with the guys now, but having Liam here, just great to um, show me around and get comfortable in the place. So, yeah, it's good now. And Liam, obviously, it's a, it's a pre season game, so as much as it's part of the training, it's a part of getting fit. But what can we expect when, when we face Sheffield Wednesday? Um, they'll be a good team. They've obviously kept a lot of the good players. Um, they'll be aggressive and they won't, they won't back down. But I think if we just focus on ourselves and play our football, I think it should be all right. Now, obviously, the two of you are now going to be staying up in Glasgow. You're going to have to be uh, you know, looking after yourself, cooking for yourself. Who, who, who do you think Azazi is going to be cope with that better? Who's the, who's the better uh, cook in the kitchen? Um. I don't know, I, I say in the Sheffield I was cooking for myself, so I'm pretty used to like taking care of myself. So being in Glasgow is not too much different to be honest. So yeah, I can take care of myself, so it'll be good. I don't know about Liam. I'll, I'll definitely give it as well, so. <laughs> yeah. I'll so let you, him take you, that one. You're going to get a chap in the door and he's going to be coming for dinner. Yeah. <laughs> now we thought since we got the two of you together, obviously fans are still trying to get to know you, but we thought what's the best way to actually ask each other and you can, can fill us in on, on who the other person is. So Liam, first of all, if you had to describe Ozazi to the Celtic fans, what kind of player can we expect to see from this man next season? A lot of energy, a good athlete, or like steps out of the out of the bike, have a right back or centre back, um, aggressive, like combative, and I think you could always rely on him. Always gives hundred percent, and yeah, just solid player. Ozazi, the same for you. Yeah. What what can the fans expect from Liam? Yeah, Liam's like a very versatile player. A box to box midfielder, he gets stuck in in tackles, gets chips in in the odd goals as well, and he's just a solid midfielder all round. Sion is very strong, dominant, and you you can expect him some true balls as well and breaking the lines. So he's as a complete player, to be honest.